Today's IT providers are driven by service levels requiring fast business response times with well-documented quality of service. We at Hitachi Data Systems enable you to store, manage, access, index, search and correlate your information across various sources. Now we offer you a very cost-effective way to maintain service quality for your complex storage environment. The new web-based I.O. Performance Portal provides overview and documentation about IT consumption, I.O. operations, CPU utilization and performance per server and storage system. Create your own intuitive performance graphs and reports that immediately reveal bottlenecks and their causes. Let's show you how easy it is. We start with a standard situation we all know only too well. A business application owner is complaining about poor application performance, presumably caused by slow I.O. response times. It doesn't matter where you are or what time it is. The I.O. performance portal is cloud-based, so you just open your browser using the portal's URL. Log on to the portal. Select the storage array, the storage metric, and the suspected server. After narrowing the time range, you click Analyze and after just a few mouse clicks, you're able to demonstrate that the server shows healthy I.O. response times, which did not cause any performance degradation. After just one minute, you can now see the issues not storage, but server related. Now you just send this nice graph to your internal or external customer. Just take this graph, copy it and then click Send per email. Add a few words to show them that it's not the I.O. that's causing the problem and you kept your service commitments. The I.O. Performance Portal shows the server's workload and its impact on the storage system. You can now nicely show that the I.O. Performance is in fact not responsible for every application performance issue. Now let's look at a more complex situation. A storage system is suffering severe performance degradation causing application outages. And a second storage system which is connected to it seems to be affected. You must find out what is going on and come up with actions. Select the storage system, then the storage metric section, and this time you select this storage system, VSP Serial, to understand the performance at the storage level, time range, and click Analyze. The graph appears and you realize that the average service times are indeed poor, presumably due to high backend workload. But which servers are causing this backend workload? To find out, you choose the top 10 graph over here in the detail selection box and just hit analyze. All the settings from the previous graph are still valid so you don't have to enter them again. After a few seconds, the top 10 server graph appears, revealing the server which is causing excessive work time. Okay, that makes you curious. What on earth is the server's I.O. workload doing to cause so much trouble? Just by changing the server name, here in Server Detail, you click Analyze with the resulting graph representing the server's I.O. performance. A quick look reveals that the front-end I.O. workload is not overly high, but a low cache hit ratio and 100% random I.O. put the back-end under immense pressure. This in turn results in high average service times, causing the work time to show up in the top 10 graph. This took less than two minutes to find out, and the decision can be taken to remove the server with the highest work time from the storage system, and the nightmare will end on the spot. The server and storage graphs show continuously improving service times, and the work time in the top 10 graph significantly diminishes. That top 10 graph visually identifies those servers generating the highest workload and those causing most of the processing time spent on the storage system. After all, it's the servers with the highest work time that also give rise to significant investments in infrastructure upgrades and task forces. Now you want to send this again, but this time you also want to add a little proof about your good service quality in general and over time. So let's add that to your mail. Just change the timelines here. So let's take two weeks. There's the graph. Now you copy it over to the mail. Click send. And you just elegantly highlighted the good service that your department is providing. What you just saw would typically take days to identify. It took us just the last five minutes to do this analysis. All done and well documented. You didn't need to call anyone or get a consultant to help you. 
Bottom line, with the IO Performance Portal you can not only reduce your overhead, but you can now document your findings within your SLA and respond to your clients with unprecedented speed and ease. The IO Performance Portal from Hitachi Data Systems. Free up your admin overhead to focus on business agility.